Good morning, everybody. This is Tyler Franklin with Axis Seed. Uh, back out in the cornfield again. This morning it's not too hot. Um, got really good ground moisture in this particular location. Just wanted to highlight the, uh, the green snap tolerance between hybrids again. Uh, this is another location in Hanover County. Um, we got a completely different brand that we were comparing side by side. Uh, on the right side here, you've got Axis 114 Day 64D25, and the competitor on the left side, um, the same storm that came through and caused a lot of green snap in the other plot location, caused a lot of green snap here. This particular variety couldn't handle the wind pressure. You can look down and see this plant is completely broken off. The top's laying there on the ground. This is a really bad spot. Uh, must have been a, a heavy gust of wind that came through this particular location, but really caused a big problem here. Four rows per variety. So you've got one row, two, three, four, then you get into the 64D25 and you can see that just inches away the variety difference there is no green snap here. This variety is actually taller, it's got higher ear placement uh, but was not susceptible to the green snap. So we just wanted to highlight the importance of looking at all the variety characteristics other than just yield when you're selecting your your corn varieties. Not just yield, you need to look at green snap tolerance, drought tolerance, you need to look at your disease package, you need to look at your soil types and find out which hybrids perform better for which soil types uh, rather than just grabbing one variety because your salesperson suggested it. You need to look at everything. Um, in this particular case, you catch a bad storm, you still got 100% yield potential with this variety. Whereas this one, you would have lost significant yield. This is also a very popular competitor line. I'd say it's probably on 40% of the farms that I visited this year. 115 day corn. If you have any questions, you know where to find me.